The Sudarium of Oviedo is a cloth. What it really is, is it's, it's a sweat cloth. It's believed to be a cloth that was wrapped around Jesus' face as he died on the cross. After the carbon-14 dating came back saying the Shroud of Turin was from the Middle Ages, it's been a locked box. The custodian of the Shroud, the Archbishop of Turin, changed all the rules. And we're only going to take one sample, and then he took it from right here which is the one corner the scientists said not to take it from. A chemist at Los Alamos National Labs conclusively proved that the sample that was tested was not from the main linen body of the cloth. It's not the cloth. That didn't make any headlines, so not a lot of people know about that. And so there needs to be a compelling reason for the church to reopen the investigation into the shroud and let it be examined again. If you can show correspondence between the sudarium and the shroud, then the shroud necessarily must be older than the carbon-14 dating that was assigned to it. And if that's true, that should unlock the box and make it open to investigation again. We hear so often about how Jesus' blood paid for the forgiveness of our sins. We hear it so much that sometimes it, it even starts to lose its meaning as a real historical event. It becomes kind of abstract, but here it is. That's the blood. That's the blood that was shed right there for the forgiveness of sins. That's what this shroud means.